Hi everyone, it's Desiree. Welcome back to my channel. Thanks for joining me for another video. Today I'm going to be decorating my classic pages for the week of November 14th through the 20th. I'm going to use Essential Seasons. This one's a really cute, if you like seasonal books, this is a good seasonal book. I believe it's, I know it's available on the Happy Planners website. I'm not sure if it's a exclusive to the site. Like I'm really excited to use these for winter, but I'm going to use the fall one since we're still in fall. And I really like the color palette that they chose for these stickers. They're really pretty. So I'm going to challenge myself to only use this sticker book. We'll see how that goes. But there are all the stickers I need in here, so it, it could be possible. It's always nice to just have to only use one book. So there are quotes. There's decorative stickers. Um, there are box stickers. There's bullet points. Ooh, these are really nice bullet points. There's a long sidebar sticker. Um, some little circle stickers, box stickers, checklists. I think, yeah, I think there is enough to do just a one sticker book spread. So I'm gonna use Essential Seasons. And I think I might pull a washi first. I've been just putting top and bottom, maybe a little in the middle. Um, and then I, I can get started on pulling these stickers. All right, so I'm started, I started pulling some stickers. I really like the pink, this like peachy pink with the brown. That's like the predominant color scheme that I wanna go with. Um, and then I found this washi, which I really like these like plaid ones. I don't know, for me it's like fall and, and Christmas type washi that I like to use. I'm going to just put it down. We'll see if it works. If it doesn't work, I, I can always take it off, but I think it might work. Um, let me see. I need... Hold on. Okay, gift card. <laughs> so I can cut this off. Yeah. I think it should work. I'm gonna put it on this side first and then work on this one. And then I can kind of get an idea if it does or not. All right, for sure I'm using this um, autumn plans for this side. I haven't decided, okay, maybe I'll do this one, these two. Autumn plans. I could do it like this. Okay. So I'm actually gonna put this. I feel like if I put it here, it's too low. I kind of want to bring it down a little bit more than I normally do. Okay, and then this one can go on top. They have um, in this book some really nice checklists. I actually love how thin these are. I wish there were more dots because I like like more of a list type of checklist. Whereas like this is too much space, but I love how thin they are. So I'm gonna use, probably gonna use these. I also wanna stick some of these like cute little leaf um, stickers. You know, Mondays are not like as busy for me, so I could stick okay, I'm gonna stick a leaf there, and then I think I want to grab some more boxes. Now the only thing is, it does have boxes and everything, but there's only two sizes of boxes. I like a variety of boxes, but again, I'm gonna try to just use this book for this spread just as a challenge for myself so yeah i'm just gonna do my best with just having these size boxes i can always cut them though i feel like i should Okay, 
Wednesday's a, always a little bit busier for me. I have a few things going on on Wednesday, so six bucks there. Okay. Um, let me put a checklist down. I have this green. I'm gonna mix in the colors. I'm gonna. Just, I'm just gonna work with what they kind of gave me in this book so the the whole color scheme i mean it's a really pretty color scheme so it works okay so this one's gonna go there and then i'm gonna put another one I have this like mustardy color it's pretty so i'll put this one here for monday and then i'm just going to cut this off a little bit my box. Oh. I always lose. Oh, you know what? I took it to another room and I really don't want to grab it. So I was looking for my um, X-Acto knife, but it's not. It's not over here. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I feel like I need more, like, more boxes. Especially here. So what I'm going to do is I think I am going to take, hmm, I'll take this brown one, okay, I'm just going to do a little like cutting of this, so that way it's smaller, sorry my scissors are so dirty, okay, so I'm going to keep this top part, and then I, and put this, make like a new size of a box. To make it smaller, but I'm gonna bring it closer to me so I can actually see what I'm doing, which is helpful to try to get it to match. Okay, it actually kind of matches. Um, and then I will just cut this off like so. And then I have a smaller box that I can use to layer here because I like layering boxes, so. I feel like that works. Oops. I'm gonna put this cozy up here. So I feel like there's like a gap there that I don't want. So I think this will fit nicely here. It has been getting a little chillier for out here, so that's been nice. Like one morning it was like 40 degrees, so that's pretty chilly for out here. Okay, cool. Um, I feel like I need more decorative stuff over here. So I'm gonna go in this book See what other decorative things. Got these cute pumpkins and this little tea. I have this room. Like I said, I, Monday is not a busy day for me, so I kind of just want the little. Is this tea or is this hot chocolate? Uh, I'm going to cut the quote off just so that way it is just the decorative sticker part of the sticker at least like that I think I'm just going to stick that there because uh, Monday I don't have a lot to write in on Monday so I think that kind of works for that one. Uh, oh, there's some really good uh, bullet points in here that I can pull. These. Cute. Oh, these are cute too. Let's see. This one says, super fun. Maybe I could stick one of these. Okay. 
Not that it's fun. Well, actually, I do have something fun right there. So I'm just going to stick that one there. Um, I'm going to get some bullet points. All right, so I got my tweezers because these are like really tiny little bullet points. I love the size of these. They're so good. So I kind of want this color because I don't have very much of that around the page on this side aside from that sticker. So I think I'm going to put a couple here. And then I'll stick another one here. Okay. I think that's pretty good for that side. I'm happy with the way that looks. Now onto this side, which I do like the way the washi looks, so I'm committing to the washi. So I'm going to lay this down and it's gonna cover up the quote on the bottom, but that's not a problem. So, oh, it covered it up perfectly. Okay. So washi on the bottom. And washi on the top. Here. I'll probably put some washi within this spread, but not this washi because I feel like it'll be a little too much for this spread. All right, so I do have this box here which I like to use for the weekend. Actually, I'm gonna use it for Friday and um, Saturday. Okay, I'm gonna put this. Right, let me go more into Friday. layering a little box situation over here like so I got this cute little teapot super super cute I'll stick that there and then I'm going to put down some checklists of course some checklists around the spread. Okay, so that one. Okay, let me find some other colors to use. Um, I'll use them. You know what? Let me use. I think I'm gonna use the mustard one down here. I think that would be better. Okay, mustard. And I kind of want to put, let's see if I put a box sticker. I haven't done this in a while. So let's see, a box sticker in here. And what else? I think I might just do the little like cutting of this down. Yeah, it's so the same way that I did the other one. Just cut the top off and then place these back together to the size that I want. on top okay, now I don't 
don't like the mustards here. Let me get the other color. This one. It's like... A reddish... Orangey brown. I don't know what color that is. Okay, I'm gonna fix this because it's not exactly straight. Ah. Okay, just working with what I have to work with from this book. Um, I think I might take this brown one. A lot of brown over here. Oh well, it's fine. It could be tricky working with one book, but honestly, it's nice to just not have to flip through so many books to find stickers. Um, yeah, I do like that part. That's always. Great, so, so far looking good. Um, now if you're wondering like, like how I'm gonna write in this, um, for Friday obviously I don't have a lot of space, but I'll just like kind of visually cut this box in half and write Friday over here and Saturday on this side. It's kind of like how I do it. This I probably will use just for as like a weekend box. Um, like things that I just needed to get done on the weekend. When they get done, they get done. Not that they have like a specific day. So that's kind of like how I uh, think about how I'm going to use this spread for the week. Um, for me, I don't have to have things exactly in the boxes. And sometimes things don't have to be done uh, exactly on the day I put them. Unless it's something like a meeting or, you know, something I have to take care of and be somewhere that's different but sometimes it's just like having it in my planner as a reminder of something I needed to get done for the week so and then if it doesn't get done then I just roll it into the next week that's usually how it works uh so I'm gonna do oh I like that weekend fun it's blue I didn't really add a lot of blue though so I wish there was more of the pink. I wanted it to be like more pink and brown, but apparently there isn't a lot of pink. I'm just gonna put that there. Beautiful life. Kind of like how I did that. I like that it's vertical. It's different, a little different little way of adding those to a spread. I'm just gonna add in a couple of bullet points over here. I can put two here, like so. I think it looks really cute though, it's fun. Um, so let's see, anything else that I can add? I mean, I feel like I have it pretty, like a lot going on, but a lot in a good way going on. Still have a lot of stickers left. I don't know. I think, I think I like it the way it is. There's a lot of the boxes, a lot of checklists. I have these. So a way I was thinking of using these, I'm not a fan of like the image on the outside, but I do like like the little strip of a quote. Um, I don't know if I'm going to add this on here, but I just wanted to show like how I would use these. Um, so yeah, I don't really like, I mean, it's cute. It's not terrible, but I prefer if it wasn't, if there wasn't a image on the edge. I just like, like the long little strip. So I would just cut it off and you could always save this little piece, put it in your book. Easy to keep safe in there. And then now I have a cute little, I love fall most of all, quote. Let me just stick that down here. Like so, um, I can even add 
feel like I need more blue, brown on this side. So this one says, let the memories begin. I'm just going to do the same thing. Just cut a little. Yeah, just cut it. I feel like I need to put it over here. Let the memories begin. Don't put it into the washi. Maybe I should do that with the other one. Let's see if I can try that with this one. Because I kind of like the way that looks. Oops. Okay. Cute. I love the colors. They're so pretty. All right, so that is gonna be my spread. I was able to just use one sticker book, which is awesome. I can add in a couple more. Actually, I was gonna add in some washi. I think I'm just gonna add in a couple of pieces of grid washi because I feel like it goes, it's a good neutral and it's not as busy looking as the one that I chose for the top section and bottom section. So I can just add some, just to add a little bit more of that pattern around the spread. I just like the way it looks when this is added on to the corners of some boxes. I think it's really cute. Little finishing touch for this spread. Okay, so let me add this one over here and then I will be all set. Cool. All right, so that is gonna be my spread. I hope you all enjoyed watching. I will have this book linked down in the description. I think I mentioned before, I'm not sure if it's like an exclusive to the Happy Planner, um, but if it's available in stores, I'll put that in the description. That's also available at a store so you can get a better price. But yeah, that's gonna be my spread. I hope you all enjoyed watching. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. And if you wanna see more of my videos, please hit that subscribe button and I hope to see you all in the next one.